In your life, do you feel resistance to the challenges that come, or do you welcome them as blessings and feel gratitude for the growth that you know that they're going to bring you? The experiences that are usually the hardest to face benefit us the most, because we know that when we go through times of opposition, we may need to remember that this merely is a course correction or a purifying process that your soul is seeking. I read a story recently that captured this beautifully, and it's called The Refiner's Fire. It speaks about a small group of women who are learning about the book of Malachi. And as they were studying chapter three, they came across this verse, which says he, God, will sit as a refinery and purifier of silver. Now this puzzled the women because they weren't quite sure what this meant about the character or even nature of God. So one of the women said, you know what? I'm gonna go and figure out this whole thing about refining silver. So that week, this woman made an appointment to watch an actual silversmith at his work. Now, she obviously didn't mention anything about why she was interested or why she was coming outside of her own curiosity about the process of making silver. Now, as she watched the silversmith hold the piece of silver over the fire and let it heat up, he began to explain that in refining silver, one needed to hold the piece of silver directly in the middle of the fire because that's where the flames were the hottest. That's where the heat could actually burn away the impurities. The woman thought about God holding us in that same hot spot. And she thought again about that verse of he sits as a refinery and purifier of silver. And she asked the silversmith, is it true that he had to sit there in front of the fire the whole time the silver was being refined? And the man answered yes, and explained further that not only did he have to sit there holding the silver, but he had to keep his eye on the silver the entire time it was in the fire. Because if the silver was left even a moment too long, it would be damaged. The woman falls silent. And then she asked the silversmith, well, how do you know when the silver is fully refined? And he smiled and answered, easy, when I see my image in it. If today you're feeling the heat of the world's fire on you, remember that God has his eyes on you too. And no matter how hot the flames seem to be around you, just remember, God has put you there for a very specific reason. It's to purify. You don't have to understand it. It's your purification process. And you're not alone. He is always with you, watching, supporting, guiding, isn't that just a beautiful story? Let me know what you think about this in the comment box below. Was it helpful? Did you see something for yourself? I'm interested. And if you know someone right now that's going through something, that's struggling, please share this with them. And as always, remember to like and subscribe to this channel as we are always sharing things like this that can help you live your maximum human potential. Hope you're having an amazing week. Talk to you soon.